Hey grown folks, Donna Smith again on the weekend with another grown folk topic of discussion for you. Let's talk about, you know, you, you have this teenager, you know, um, it could be a teenage daughter or a teenage son. And let's say they're around um, between the age of 16 and 19. And this teenage son of yours loved to smoke marijuana. I mean, it's just their thing. They've gotten into it. They do it, and you do it, too. Perhaps that may be where they picked it up from. Who knows? But anyway, you do it, too, and they love to do it now. Now, they've come to you and let you know that they do smoke marijuana, and they want to smoke it with you, Dad, or they want to smoke it with you, Mom, and they would prefer to do that then they have to go out and, you know, do it with others. So at, when you're at home and you're chilling and you're having your joy and you're kicking back and relaxing, your teenager comes and asks you for a hit of the joint as well. Now, there's two ways to look at that. Some would say, well, I'm kind of glad that they came to me and that they want to do it with me. That way I can kind of monitor the high and, you know, I can kind of, you know, monitor the the, the product, you know, because they, they usually are smoking your stuff. So you know where your stuff come from. So, I mean, the parent is okay with that. And then you have some that's, are you kidding me? I wouldn't sit up and get high nor drink with my child. Yes, that's still my child, regardless of them being 18 or 19 years old. They still are my child, and I don't get down like that. If something goes foul or, or whatever, or they get hooked up on some stuff even deeper, I don't want to be a part of that. You know, they really shouldn't be smoking it at all. I can smoke it, but they shouldn't do what I do. They should do what I tell them to do. What's your thoughts? How would you handle that if your teenage son or daughter came to you and wanted to get high with you smoking marijuana? And then you went and got the product and usually do and make it readily available for them when they do. Because, you know, they they're, they don't have it like that at this point. They're still trying to get it like that. But you, you got the money, you got the resources, and usually you have it. But what would you do? How would you handle that? I mean, is it is it that because marijuana is, um, some would say, not a harsh drug? It's a, it's, it's a, re a relaxing drug? Is it something that, that helps people in a lot of ways and, and harm them? Is that why it's okay? Or is it okay? Think about it. Get back with me.